Good evening, everyone. Welcome to another episode of the Avocado Insider series. It's your host, Harshad Gauda. In this episode, we continue our discussion with NetFM Israel and we talk about the difference between inline drippers and online drippers. If you have any questions about commercial avocado farming, post your questions in the comment section down below and I'll ask uh, the experts uh, those questions and come back to you with a reply or create a separate video about it. Uh, thank you, thank you very much. And um, I got a lot of insight about the um, avocado. But what <coughs> I can conclude uh, um, uh, one thing that at least two deep lines we should uh, go ahead with this one uh, with the discharge of say one liter to two liter uh, with the spacing of around 0 0.30 to uh, 50 uh, centimeter max to max because uh, root zone of the crop is hardly 80 percent 87 percent of root zone is uh, within 20 centimeter of uh, soil depth as of, as of now, I don't have uh, the presentation of uh, Uniram and um, uh, DNPC. But, but the mo most of the things that was covered in the Danish presentation. And uh, both both the products, uh, Uniram and uh, DNPC is already with us in India. And uh, we can have, we have the production of this uh, two deep lines. What and, uh, yeah. Also, what I said, you know, it's a, it's a pretty it's a pretty field. We don't really need uh, too much compensation. And Arias, I think I wrote you a mail. I think Arias can do the job. Also, we, we should look at the farmers, uh, you know, capabilities. And and uh, the subsidy scheme goes for the Arias. It will not go for the union. So let's. We need two drip lines. That's for sure. With the spacing yeah. of 50, 40 centimeters. But again, we can look on the on the price and the economics and, and decide together with the client what exactly we will supply. Uh, another question. Yeah. So I have used PCJ and for that uh, you get the uh, dripper uh, separately and you attach it to the drip line, the lateral line, right? How does that work in Uniram? Like, is it uh, an external uh, product that you attach it to the drip line or does it come attached? No, no, no. So it's an integral drip line. It's a deeper it's inside. It's inside. It's inside. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I suggest you use the line that you use for the PCJ. You use for for heat mitigation in the future. You can use it for. A, I, I hope it uh, will be suitable for for use it for for the heat mitigation. And uh, you have to put a new drip lines. No, no, no. The yes. the PCJ that I used that was for a different plantation. That was for dragon fruit. Okay, no, no, just to make sure that you understand our shit. Yeah. When we're talking about Dripnet and Uniram and Aris, yeah. what was uh, mentioned in this conversation, all of those drippers are coming with the drip line, with the lateral right. already inserted from the internal part of the of the of the lateral. Okay? okay. You can go yeah. into our site or better yet to go into Netafim India site. And uh, look for a uh, uh, Uniram, and you will see that the dripper is inserted within the internal part of the drip line, and there yeah. is a hole on the on the wall, and the uh, water are coming out. Narenda, I'm sure, will be able to uh, explain it much better in in Indian, so you will uh, understand it. The advantage of it that you don't need to work; it comes in the roll, and you just. Mm -hmm. Put it on the soil and you start the irrigation. Okay. Uh, the like Danny said, if you want to uh, clog drippers between the trees, yeah. there are uh, because you want to save water or you want to save fertilizers or you don't want to create uh, weeds, so there are option for the first year to use a ring that goes over the. Uh, lateral, yeah, exactly what Dan is showing right now. Mm -hmm. uh, so this ring, and you see the hole of the dripper. Yeah, the ring goes over the hole and clog it in the, for the first years. So this is the possibility. Okay. I have to admit, if you won't do it, it's not going to be a big disaster. You're going to waste some water, and you're going to waste some fertilizers. Um, no. 
not something uh, dramatically. So okay. the, this is the, the difference between inline drippers and online drippers. Yes. Narendra, please take them with the, with the, uh, uh, person to person to make sure that they understand the difference. Sure, sure, Do sure. They, I, I'm just they, presenting. Uh, I'm presenting this one. Um, This is was exactly the PCJ has to be put on the lateral. Yeah. However, uh, the DNPC Aries and uh, Uniram will be inside the lateral. I will show you in the next slide. Okay. This is what is the advantages of uh, in Hindi. Uh, this is the complete system. I will straight away go to. Um, uh, this, this is the integral integral system. The dripper right. is inside the lateral, okay. like this one, like this one. Okay. Narendra, can you go back to the slide with the, this is it, this is the house. Can you go back to the slide with the soils, please? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, this one, yeah. Yes. So this here, we see the difference in, in, in water distribution in different soil characteristic so you see that in your case i guess that uh, uh, your soil definitely after your the cultivation that you have made is somewhere between light soil and medium soil maybe a bit more to the light soil because of the ridges because of the beds and therefore the uh, water distribution goes down very much and this is why we recommend to bring more drippers per meter to make sure that there is a connection of wetted strip line along the row and not to make islands of, of wetted area. So this is this is also important to, to understand. Guys, anything else? I hope you, you agree with us that after this uh, presentation, the best solution for you is an integral two drip line system with fertigation machine. If not, Narendra will make sure that you. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I will take it further later on uh, by discussing individual uh, by surveying the plot and all. And explaining them properly about the DNPC and uh, Uniram. Excellent. I had a question. Uh, since this uh, presentation was quite insightful. Uh, would it be possible for me to get a copy of the presentation? Like I saw it was recorded earlier. So can you send me the file later on? Danny. Uh, OK. There's, uh, I have multiple farmers who would find this insightful. So I was thinking of uploading it uh, on my channel if it's OK with you guys. Yeah, I think uh, I also think maybe we'll have to recall back on certain issues in future. Yes. So if Harsis has the material, I think uh, he's uh, accessible to us and then it will be very helpful for all of us. And uh, to conclude, I think I must thank all of you for sharing our experiences and your recommendations. We take note of that and then uh, we would uh, be discussing again with Mr. Maddy, who had been to my floor and had surveyed the area. And then uh, we'll, we'll again narrate him uh, your recommendations. And then uh, maybe we we'll get back to Harshis once again after things are finalized with Mr. Maddy. Thank you so much, everybody. Okay. Narendra? Uh, Narendra, I have, I have recorded this uh, meeting. So if you want to use it, your clients, so it's your in in the Teams uh, platform, and you can uh, share it with your uh, clients. So feel free. Thank you, thank you. Yes, yes, we will use it. Yeah, yeah. Maybe I will add just one one more comment. Uh, I think we are in a way with some kind of historical moment. I mean, Harshit is working on it for a few years, but the penetration of avocado to India is just start now. We have a lot of experience and knowledge, and uh, when you grow it in Pedro rice, it's something. Uh, simple when you grow it on mountains and other places. Uh, I think we have uh, the Tofim has the right uh, solution for this. 
And also when the tree is growing, also the, the problems are growing. So we'll be like to, to be on your side yeah. along this journey because uh, I believe we can help. Thank you so much. I need your help. You're welcome. Good. Keep in touch, Ashit. Guys, Narendra. Thank you. Thank you. Thank bye. you very much. Bye. Bye. Thank you so much. Bye thank bye. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, Dani is you and Dubey and uh, Harshit. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Harshit, I would like. I hope you found the video interesting. Uh, I'll be producing more videos like this over the coming weeks. So please subscribe to my channel. And that way, you'll automatically get notified whenever I post something new. Thank you for watching. Bye.